Hey guys, so finally Rode released the 2.1 uh, firmware update. Uh, it's a full version, it's finally available. I'll put the link in the description so you can download it yourself. And I'm gonna show you a few different uh, features that are updated. So the first thing you're gonna notice on the new firmware um, is the lights have different colors now to color code each mic input so uh also they, they released the new uh rubber mic covers or cable covers actually uh that are coincide with each uh, color for each microphone secondly there is no settings button to get to the settings from the home screen so what you have to do is go into, hit the SIM card and go back, hit the back button. You have all the settings. So there's the headphone settings where you can boost the microphone or limit uh, the volume. Also, there's audio processing. I already have the effects edit mode uh, already uh, enabled. So when I do go to microphone settings, I can actually edit each effect on the microphone, on each microphone. So I wanna change that. I can change it or I can go back to default. I do change it and I don't like it. So and as for each effect on each microphone. So one thing that I really like about the new firmware update is the settings for the smartphone phone and the USB. So if I go to the smartphone and the U or the USB, they're both the same. Uh, go to presets and you can preset it to sound uh, different. So you can have uh, uh, non effects on it or a phone call effect or a speech effect or music. So when you do use your Bluetooth or your TRS, TRRS cable, you can have it sound uh, or just like music or, you know, the phone call effect or just regular speech. Another thing that, uh, to go into operations and I'm gonna broadcast me enable the broadcast meters so when you go to the home screen now you can see the meters for the levels of your audio coming in So you also have the automatically mute the outputs, disable, disable the level knobs or enable the prefade listen. So there's the tons of new options, tons of new settings for the uh, Rodecaster Pro. 2.1 firmware update that was just released yesterday, June 9th. So take a look, um, download it. I'll put the link in, in the description below so you can download it and check it out yourself. If you don't have the Rodecaster Pro, uh, get the Rodecaster Pro. It's very, very convenient for podcasting, of course. Also for um, YouTube 
creation for live music for studio recording so tons of options that you can uh, use the Rodecaster Pro for also they also released a uh, USB battery pack to where you can or not a battery pack but a USB power pack that you can use to port your uh, or carry your uh, Rodecaster Pro anywhere you want to do the podcast or any kind of audio recording so check it out uh, like I said I'll put everything in the, in the description that you need to know I do a more in depth review of the Rodecaster Pro update the 2.1 firmware update once I get into it so uh, like the video if you like the video subscribe to the channel and hit the notifications button to let you know when we post another video 